Scorpions. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Scorpions. Um, what is coming up for you, Scorpions, in the Sagittarius season? You are water energy. So let's see what is coming up. You have a major arcana. The energy of the star is in the reverse. All right. Um, so this is the Sagittarian period. It begins from March 21st until April 19. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. Remember to use the link below to see whether you choose crystal one, two, or three. All right, Scorpion, we see the energy of the star is in the reverse in the week of the first week, the week of the 21st to the 28th. Um, the energy of the star is about, um, this is an air sign, and whenever the energy of the star comes up, it is all about um, your wishes and dreams. It's not going to be coming out. Whatever you wanted, it is not going to be transpiring, all right? Then we have this eight, the energy of the eight of cups. Um, a situation is now over, but you did not successfully come out of this situation. So whatever that was happening and transpiring, um, a lot of you had hope and wish for something to happen, but it is uh, it didn't happen. And I see the energy of the eight of cups. A lot of you um, could be having some sort of an issue with a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion man. A lot of you had hope and wish for something to happen for a Pisces cancer or a scorpion man. Maybe you wanted a new start with this person. It's not going to be happening. I see that a lot of you men, you scorpion men, 50 years and older or men on the whole are going to be having some sort of an issue or problem in the third week. You are having the energy April 5 to April 11. You're going to be having some sort of a problem. Then we recognize that in the last week, new love is coming in the week of the 12th um, until the 19th, 12 until the 19th of April. A new love could be coming in. A lot of you could be finding yourself pregnant in this week. Okay, so Scorpion, you have the energy of the star and major arcana in the reverse. Uh, you have the eight of cups also in the reverse. Um, your wishes and dream is not going to be coming through um, for some of you and you men are standing up in the fourth week all right let's see what is coming up so the energy of the star is about your wishes and your dream and I see a lot of you are now worried some sort of a problem some sort of a issues your wishes and your dream a lot of you are now worried a lot of you um, are now desperate desperation is here with some sort of a relationship some sort of a relationship that a lot of you scorpions are in you're now desperate because you were hoping for either a new start or hoping that um someone would have to return to you um you haven't heard from this person you're desperate to know what is transpiring you want to know what is happening with this person a lot of you scorpion was in love with someone and now you're desperate to find out where is this relationship is going to so in the week of the 21st until the 28th a lot of you are going to be in some sort of a desperate situation with your relationship or with a new love someone um this could be a relationship problems marriage problems issues um new love looking for love um you know problems with relationship a lot of desperation you're going to be having a whole lot of desperation because some of you were hoping for some sort of uh, happiness and joy in a relationship or in a love affair your marriage could be on the rocks uh, relationship situation is on the rock so a lot of you scorpions are going through a whole lot of situation in this week and a lot of you have to be recognizing that hey the problems the issues the situation that i'm trying uh, going through in my love life a lot of problems in your love life so um desperation desperation with your relationship with your marriage a whole lot of desperation with relationship and marriage so you got to be aware of what is happening and what is transpiring because uh, you're going to be dealing with your wife your husband <clears throat> your um you know if you're in a relationship you're going to be de dealing with a lot of problems and a lot of issues that is going to be coming up so be aware of this so between the the 
the first week which is um, the week of uh, um, the 21st to the 28th a whole lot of problems and relationship issues so so it is um, yeah uh, ladies and gentlemen this is uh, a situation where you have to be aware of the things that is happening the energy of the eight of cups what is the energy of the eight of cups it is Saturn in Pisces a whole lot of problems ending to marriage and relationship could be coming up a whole lot of problems whenever Saturn is in Pisces this is about a whole lot of shake up emotional shakes up that is going to be happening and this is going to be affecting you heavily um, it's going to be affecting your marriage your relationship um, endings is coming in when Saturn comes in in a planet endings it's coming in so I see some sort of an endings between you and a Pisces could be transpiring and this ending is going to be shaking up a whole lot of things because this is Saturn in Pisces so some of you um, emotionally you're going to be emotionally bounce all over the place when it comes up to the week of the 29 until um, the uh, the first the 29 until the 5th of April a whole lot of emotional problems emotional problems that is going to be affecting you all right let's see so <clears throat> with kids if you have a, a Pisces kids a whole lot of problems for this kids this kid can be um, yeah some sort of a problem all right so um scorpions you're having a whole lot of problems young people you're going to be having some sort of a peace you're going to be released out of some sort of a unconventional emotional situation that you were going through finally you're going to be released so young people you're going to be released out of some sort of an emotional roller coaster that you have been on for a very very long time a lot of you was on some sort of a undesirable emotional roller coaster that was creating a whole lot of problems so and it was caused by um, you know relationship someone you were in relationship with or um, your partner could have caused this emotional roller coaster a lot of you are going to be having problems with your child mother or father okay and that created a whole lot of issues but young people you are going to be finally being released out of some sort of a Orb, orb thing that you got caught up with. This thing was very emotional, and uh, whatever that was happening and transpiring, this thing was extremely emotional. People are now recognizing and finding out the truth about what was happening, and you are going to be released. So, a lot of you young scorpions are going to be having some sort of a new start. Peace is going to be coming in. The emotional roller coaster that you have been going through is now going to be finally, finally ending, and a lot of you are going to be happily moving forward, okay? Because Saturn in Pisces is as if a Pisces is going to be releasing you, or you're going to be just released out of some sort of an unconventional situation that you got caught up with and was creating a whole lot of emotional roller coaster for you. As we look at the third week, the third week is the energy of the fifth until the eleventh, and um, you, um, uh, Scorpion men, your friends, you Scorpion men, um, let's see what is coming up. Some sort of a new contract is going to be coming in for a Pisces. Whether the Pisces man is, I see the Pisces man is going to be receiving a new contract so this is good this is positive this is positive alignment of energy a lot of you scorpions um i see some sort of a new contract is going to be coming up um for a pisces man whoever the spices man is if it's your husband um your father your husband whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring um, I see a new contract is going to be coming up for this person. So, um, a scorpion men, some of you could be um wanting some sort of a new contract or trying to create some sort of a new contract for a friend. A lot of you scorpion men could be doing that, but I see this um a contract is going to be coming up for a scorpion man. So let's say that you wanted some sort of a help or um 
yeah you wanted some sort of a help a friend is going to be trying to create a new contract for some of you but if you were in line for a new contract or a new promotion a Pisces man is going to be receiving it then when we're looking at marriages I see a whole lot of you men are trying to heal your marriage is trying to balance out your marriage you are men are trying to protect your wife um, from whatever is happening and transpiring a lot of you who are uh, in a relationship with a scorpion man I see that this man is going to be trying to balance out uh, some sort of a marriage issue and problem and this is going to be good so I see some sort of a new contract is going to be coming up for a Pisces whatever the Pisces is and whatever is transpiring I see some sort of a new contract is going to be coming up for a Pisces so you know if this is your father your ma your husband um, whoever this person is it could be a brother or a friend I see that they are going to be receiving a new contract okay because they're going to be recognizing um, and seeing a new contract whoever is having problems in your marriage I see that you men are going to be trying to resolve the problems that is here in your marriage whatever is happening and transpiring a lot of you men are going to be balancing out the issues and problems that you have been dealing with with your marriage okay so a lot of you married men are going to be trying to heal a situation so it's as if you were having problems with your wife or you were having problems uh, um, with some sort of a contract I see that you are going to be receiving a new contract all right so that is going to be good I see a Pisces man could be making sure that you receive a new contract all right we have the ace of um, cups in um, the last week the week of the 12 until the 19 you have the energy of the ace of cups and the ace of cups some sort of a new love is coming in from overseas and um, some of you were in a relationship with someone overseas I see a whole lot of problem a lot of problems so it could be um, you men recognize that a young person from overseas have created a whole lot of problems in your world is this your child or is this uh, um, a family member a young family member but you know this person is coming in as if they are showing you love but this person have a lot of problems they are dealing with they're dealing with a lot of problems this pro this person is like this person um, was born in another country and you're having a lot of conflicts with this person you had some sort of a feelings for this person but you're recognizing that who this person show up to be is not who they are so it could be a new love that you have met this person um, you know is from another country it's a foreigner and you're recognizing that uh, this person is not who they say they are and a lot of you are very upset about what has transpired because it's, it's as if a lot of you you know this person comes in very false so I see conflicts with this person whoever this person is came in very very false and you're recognizing and you're seeing the conflicts that has been going on and the conflicts that this new love brought in your life so a lot of you scorpion recognize that this person from another country um, have uh, you know this is a foreigner from another country created a whole lot of problems and issue for you scorpion and you're now recognizing this and realizing Jesus this person I've created so much problems so much issue for me and now I have to be resolving this and you're having a whole lot of um, conflicts with this person so it's as if this person is a new love whoever this person is it's as if this person is a new love whoever this person is you're going to be recognizing that this person have brought in a whole lot of problems a whole lot of issue and a whole lot of conflicts in your world some of you it could be a colleague or, or a employer or employee and this is a young person okay or this person if they're not young there is someone who is from another country and they have brought in so much problems in your world that is creating a whole lot of issues okay so if you notice the theme of this is all about love it's all about love and it's all about uh, relationship marriages uh, relationship new love that is coming in people that you're finding out that they have not been honest um, you know the ace of cups is all about uh, new love coming in your world 
um, love and happiness but um, you know you think that you are uh, happy with this person but you're recognizing that this person as a um, you know bring some sort of an issue and problem in your world that you're thinking hey um, you know I really care about you but you know this is all of your luggage this baggage is uh, um, that you have brought into my world and is now affecting my world so I see a whole lot of you scorpions is going to be having a whole lot of issue um, I see a lot of you who have met someone from another country or another place however this is happening and transpiring I see that you are going to be recognizing the unfair um, ness that this person brought in a lot of luggage and baggages for you a lot of you that your kids live in another place or another city I see that you really love this child but you recognize that um, you and this child and their family are not really getting on you recognize that every time this family this child comes over there's a lot of conflicts in the house there's a lot of problems there's a lot of issues there's um, a whole lot of conflicts issues and problems in your world and this person has brought in all of these problem issues and in your world and you're going to be recognizing no I don't need this in my world this is not what I have so this um, Sagittarian season is a young Sagittarian that a lot of you are dealing with is this your child whoever this young Sagittarian is or this a uh, young person is it's coming up as a child for a lot of you and it's a young Aries Leo Sagittarian person and they um, and they are creating so much problem and really sending you off your um, off your 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 in frequency is as if this person is bouncing you off your frequency is as if you're bouncing from the mirror whenever the wall whenever these people are in your world so whoever this young um, person is that is from another country or another city has created a whole lot of issues and I see conflicts is here for this person and you're getting yourself out because you're like I'm not taking I'm not going to be taking on all of your problems because I recognize that because of you my life has been bouncing off um, because you have uh, created so much problems and issue in my world so a lot of you it could be your child it could be um, you know someone from another country another but this is definitely someone from another country and a lot of you are having if you're in a relationship uh, um, and you're having a relationship with someone in another country I see that a whole lot of conflicts this is like a new love someone you have met but you both are going through a lot of conflicts okay this new love that come in is creating a whole lot of conflicts for you or they have their own problems that they're bringing in your world and you're like yes this is too much um, I really love this person I really care about this person but I think that I am taking on too much of this person problem I need to stand back oh, and let go of the situation to let it work out so that they can deal with their issues and I can deal with mine because I can't take this person on with their problems also so I see a lot of you scorpions are going to be recognizing because you're having issues whether this is a family member or whatever you're going to be saying I do love this person but we are having too much conflicts okay and it's a situation where it could be a family member that is living in another place another city and you're recognizing you know I'm always having conflicts with this person I really do love this person I have to try and figure out so it could be a sister that live our, our brother who lives in another country um, another place but every time you're both having some sort of a conflict some sort of an issue look at yourself scorpions because sometimes you scorpion fly off the handle while another person is just sitting back and trying to relax and look at a situation in a different way but you scorpion still um are trying to fly off the handle and you need to um you know calm yourself down there is a situation where you need to calm yourself down because there is someone who really care about some of you scorpion but because you go so quickly and you pop off in any minute and that sort of a thing 
it is creating a whole lot of conflicts between you and this person and you know if you just calm down you and this person could have a very very good relationship and if you recognize um, scorpion you are always having conflicts with people so you gotta recognize what is your fault in this situation and work to resolve whatever the fault the problem the issue is because you're going to be recognizing that you're always going to be having some sort of a conflicts because you are just um, going out you have this fire energy because it's water and especially if you are a, a Pisces a, a, a scorpion with fire energy you're having this fire energy and some of you who are having kids that is Aries the fire sign person they're going to be bringing out and dragging out the blood from underneath your end so you gotta be aware and gotta recognize that this person is a child but you know you love this person but this person just bring out the blood from under you, your nails and you have to recognize you can't give your power away to this person so scorpion this was wonderful um please remember use the link below in order to choose crystal one two three or four in order for you to help you to accelerate and move forward and know what is coming up and how to deal with the problems and the issues I do love you guys please like share thumbs up um, leave a message as to how it is happening these work with the weekly reading so this is going to be good as you understand the energy of the weekly readings and what this um, uh, airy season is all about use the weekly reading in order to understand these people and this situation that is going to be coming up in the weeks for you I do love you guys I gotta go but remember to use the link below to get to these crystal reading namaste until next time